Did you know that in the 1400s, every Ottoman Sultan who came to power was entitled to kill all his brothers? This practice is known as fratricide, a brutal and heart-wrenching aspect of Ottoman history. This cruel custom gave every newly appointed Sultan the right to kill his brothers in order to establish his reign as soon as he took the throne. It was because any living brother posed a threat to the Sultan and could also be used by the elite soldiers known as Janissaries to gain more power or control over the Sultan. The fratricide practice in the Ottoman Empire first occurred in 1298 when Dundar Bey was executed for collaborating with the Tekfirs and rebelling against his nephew, Osman Ghazi. However, it was only formalized and legalized by Sultan Mehmed the Conqueror when he came to power. He declared that his illustrious children and grandchildren ascending the throne would have the right to execute their brothers. You'd be surprised to know that Sultan Mehmed killed 19 of his brothers. This brutal practice lasted until 1603 when Sultan Ahmed I chose not to kill his brothers and finally abolished the law of fratricide. This decision was believed to be influenced by Kozum Sultan, his wife. If you were one of the sultans ascending to the throne during that time, would you have had the heart to kill your brothers solely for the sake of power? Or would you abolish the law just like what Sultan Ahmed I did? Comment, execute or abolish.